Hi, welcome back to our Friday Spectacular with Lynn. And Allie here with your March 24th edition of DSMS TV News. Now to a video with Mr. Rosenberg. Rosenberg here to talk to you about the upcoming AIM Science Test next Tuesday. All 8th grade students will be taking the AIM Science Test next Tuesday, March 28th. Yes, 7th graders, you get a pass on this one, at least until next year. 8th graders, please check the Media Center windows to see what room you'll be testing in. Most 8th graders will be testing in their 4th period classroom with their 4th period teacher. Yes, some of you will be moving to other classrooms, so please check the lists so you know what classroom you will be testing in. Please bring a book Tuesday to read after you finish your test. There are no, and I mean no, electronics allowed out during the testing. Please do your best on this test. It is important for your teachers and our school to see where all our students are with their learning and growth in science. Students, in order to do your best, please make sure you are rested. This means get a good night's sleep for several days leading up to the test, and please eat a good, healthy breakfast that morning so you have plenty of energy. We know everyone will do great. Thank you, and have a great day, Desert Shadows. Eighth graders, if your name is not on the list posted on the Media Center window, see Mr. Rosenberg or Miss Chin. Now to another video with Mr. Hummer. Good morning, Desert Shadows Middle School. This is Mr. H in our new studio. And I'm here to share an important message about equity and our school climate. At Desert Shadows Middle School, we have students that come from all different backgrounds, different family situations, religions, and different beliefs. This, I believe. I believe that our differences represent an opportunity to learn. And when well respected, our differences make us a stronger people. I believe that our country has made progress in this area over the last 200 years or so, but I also believe that at times we fail. We need to think about these issues and improve. At Desert Shadows Middle School, students have, been, have sometimes been the target of racist, sexist, or homophobic remarks. Students at Desert Shadows this year have heard the N-word, slurs about a student's country of origin, their faith, or their sexuality. This is unacceptable. This must stop. It's in violation of our school's code of conduct. Mr. Rosenberg and I have addressed some of these instances, but they don't always get reported. Some students seem to treat this as just joking or friendly teasing, but it's not. It's not funny, it's not acceptable, and we're gonna be addressing this more clearly as a school. We've discussed this with teachers, and now I'm here expressing this to you. I believe that as administrators, teachers, parents, and students, we should think about how we speak to one another. And when we hear remarks about race, ethnicity, and gender, they should be kind and appropriate. I believe that when slurs are made, when someone crosses the line, they should be reported to a teacher, administrator, or a family member. I believe that schools should be a place where everyone feels safe and respected. I believe that in speaking out and working together, we can make Desert Shadows an even better school. In the days and weeks ahead, I hope to invite teachers and perhaps some students to speak out on these morning announcements and answer this question. What do you believe? Festival for Girls Basketball is tomorrow at Shadow Mountain High School. 7th graders will begin their games at 8 o'clock and 8th graders will begin their games at 11. If you want to enjoy our Desert Shadows chorus groups and artists, come over to Paradise Valley Mall on Saturday and Sunday. Times will be from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Club soccer is back this year. Coach Saraga said the Horizon Varsity Boys soccer coach will be here beginning next Tuesday, the 28th. The team is only $30 and you can get a registration form in PE or the back office at Quick because there are only 24 spots on the team. Now to the birthdays. Everybody at DSMS, it's Lucas with the birthdays. Our only birthday is our very own Miss Hoffman. Woo! Woo! Now back to the anchor.
Now to a soundtrack video of Pawn 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 requested by one of our students. Brace for anime. You don't know where I'm going to. Wrestling begins on Wednesday, March 29th. You must have your registration form and $65 fee paid before you can wrestle. You can turn in your registration form and your payment in the back office during lunch or after school. It is not before school. That's all for today, Signwinders. Have a fantastic Friday and a wacky weekend. Is in my head. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>